हेलो स्टूडेंट दिस इज फर्स्ट चैप्टर ऑफ जियोग्राफी रिसोर्स एंड डेवलपमेंट चिल्ड्रन वी हैव कम्पलीटेड फर्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ द चैप्टर दैट वॉज लैंड एज अ रिसोर्स एंड टूडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग सेकेंड टॉपिक ऑफ दिस चैप्टर दैट इज सॉइल एज ए रिसोर्स इन दिस टॉपिक वी विल डिस्कस अ लॉट अबाउट हाउ सॉइल इज अ रिसोर्स हाउ सॉइल इज यूजफुल टू अस एज वी नो इन डे टू डे लाइफ ऑल्सो soil is very important thing for us it is a medium of plant growth and support different type of living organism it is useful for growing crops and many more thing so let us discuss about its formation children soil takes millions of years to form a few centimeter in depth and it is very important for the plant growth and support different types of living organism so let's have a look before discussing factors that help in formation of soil i show you a diagram that is on page number 7 and you are supposed to draw this diagram in your notebook this is a picture of soil profile and different layers are given over here how soil is formed so how soil is formed there are various factors like relief parent rock and bed rock climate vegetation and other forms of life and time are important factors in the formation of soil forces of nature such as change in temperature actions of running water wind and glacier activities of decomposer etc contribute to the formation of soil along with chemical and organic changes which take place in the soil are equally important right so here are various things various factors that are responsible for the formation of soil we can understand this thing like factors that help in formation of soil so as you know that there are various factors that are responsible for the formation of soil like relief parent rock climate vegetation changes in temperature action of running water action of wind etc so here you can see various factors are there which are responsible for the formation of soil these factor help in the formation of soil okay now we will see classification of soils india has very relief features landforms climatic realm and vegetation types these have contributed in the development of various types of soil so what are various types of soil in india there are different types of soils like alluvial soil black soil red soil yellow soil laterite soil arid soil forest soil so there are many types of soil and we can divide this soil into six part classification of soils classification of soils we can classify into six part first is alluvial soil alluvial soil is most widely spread soil because in most part of the country this kind of soil um, we can see everywhere second is black soil 
since it is black in color that's why it is known as black soil third is red and yellow soil and fourth is laterite soil fifth is arid soil and sixth is forest soil in this way this is the classification of soil six types of soils are here that are found in our country so we will first discuss about alluvial soil look in ncert alluvial soil this is the most widely spread and important soil in fact the entire northern plain are made of alluvial soil how because in northern plains this the soil is brought by three important uh, river system of himalayan river that is the indus the ganga the brahmaputra so these have been deposited by three important himalayan river system the indus the ganga and the brahmaputra these soils are extend in rajasthan and gujarat through a narrow corridor alluvial soil is also found in the eastern coastal plains particularly in the deltas of mahanadi the godavari the krishna and the kaveri rivers so not only in northern plains not only northern plains are formed with alluvial soil but also southern part of our country alluvial soil is also found in the eastern coastal plains particularly in the deltas of mahanadi the godavari the krishna and the kaveri this soil alluvial soil can be divided into two part one is bangar and the other one is khadar bangar is known for its uh, kakar modules while khadar is known for its fine particles bangar is old alluvial soil while khadar is new alluvial soil so i hope you understood alluvial soil uh deposited by the ganga the indus the brahma putra and also found also found in the deltas of mahanadi kaveri krishna godavari etc it can be divided this alluvial soil can be divided into two parts one as i uh, told you bangar and the other one is khadar bangar is old alluvial soil while khadar is new alluvial soil it is it has kankar module and it is known for its uh fine particles i hope you understood this